This is your CBS 46 News Update, brought to you by West Shore Home. Good Wednesday afternoon, I'm Karen Greer. Day three of early voting is underway and there still appears to be record turnout here in Georgia. Some polling locations in Metro Atlanta where counties are reporting up to nine hour wait times. The Secretary of State attributing the long lines to safety protocols put in place across the state to keep everyone safe during the pandemic. Tonight, Stacey Abrams will join Democratic U.S. Senate nominee John Ossoff for Virtual One Georgia Live Town Hall. Abrams and Ossoff will discuss the importance of early voting and take live questions from Georgia voters. That's happening tonight at 730. You can watch it live on Facebook, Twitter and YouTube. A crime alert after a man shot outside a home in southeast Atlanta. Right now, police are looking for evidence where it happened on Lakewood Avenue near McDonough Boulevard. The man made it to a nearby gas station and flagged down an officer saying he was shot in the chest. We're told the 26 year old victim is in stable condition and police are asking if you have any information, you call them or Crime Stoppers 404-577-TIPS. Your Atlanta Braves two games away from going to the World Series, but first they need to beat those Dodgers game three tonight. Can they sweep in Texas? We'll let you know about all the excitement as we'll be live from Truist Park starting at four. So Rodney going to be some good weather for folks to go outside, either watch Falcons and their new crew or the Braves. Yeah, Karen, whatever you want to do this afternoon and evening as you social distance outdoors, the weather will definitely cooperate. Temperatures in the 70s throughout the rest of the afternoon, pushing 80 degrees really by seven o'clock. It's down to 72 degrees. Uh, and if you are going to be out later on this evening, you're going to need the jacket 66 degrees by nine o'clock. Uh, this really nice weather will continue for the next several days. I do want to point out more clouds on Thursday. A shower is possible east of Metro Atlanta on Thursday. And then on Friday, there is a 20% chance of a shower as a cool front moves through. And then behind that front, it's already chilly in the mornings, but starting Friday, it'll be chilly in the mornings and in the afternoons this weekend. Mostly sunny skies both days, but we start in the 40s and we end up in the 60s. This has been your personal news update from CBS 46 News, brought to you by West Shore Home, Atlanta's one-day bath remodeler.